<laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough 2 8 The potted ghost is the boss of this castle. Of course. <laughs> and now and now there's nothing here. <laughs> we just go in. There's no transition from the outer world. We just kinda plopped into the castle. And there are these posts in the lava that never burn, and you can stand on them safely, so don't worry about landing on them or anything like that. Oh, that was a one-up that I just lost there. Uh, hopefully, hopefully there aren't any sort of red coins that I lost there, because, you know, whenever you see those sorts of shy guys, you just never, ever know. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just gonna kinda carefully work my way around here. And try and collect things as you go ahead of time because, well, as you can tell, this, this platform kind of only gives you one shot at things, so, yeah, oh, <laughs> I'm not letting that one follow me. Oh, no, you don't. That was, that's just going to cause me all sorts of ire. I wonder if I should keep my extra flame there for the future, but I would like to get my tongue out for the sake of eggs, because I'm eggless at the moment. So, yeah, I'm just going just gonna to kind of leisurely... Go around here, and we're gonna jump to all three of these. There we go. Now, watch watch the coloration of these platforms. You're gonna want to jump faster when you're on the yellow and the red platforms as opposed to the green ones, because they fall a lot faster. But anyway, 20... We're off. <laughs> there wasn't really much uh, much in the way of getting stars and stuff like that, now was there? Uh, I think that there's a secret pathway if you go low. So, low we go. <laughs> ah, shoot. Let me get that to um, respawn here. Can I get that? Yeah, I'll just... I <laughs> just want to do this a, a little bit more efficiently than how I've been doing here. Because I just want to get all nice in a straight line along the ground there. Right there. Ah, that'll do, I guess. I think I'll hit all three. There we go. See, it's got, you got to have that slight angle, but I didn't have quite the right angle. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Shoot, by the way, those uh, thorns, you can break them with eggs, but they are instant kills, so do not touch them. They are hot lava. Yup, oh jeez. Uh, uh, hold on a sec. Uh, I just want to see here. I'll, I'll take the other path back the other way when I come back through this pipe, because I think there's something that I need from this pipe, actually. Uh, or maybe not. Maybe this is just a secret route with the train. Yay! <laughs> Woo! I think it is just a secret route, actually. So our objective is to get through this as quickly as possible without getting shy guide. Go, 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 go! <laughs> I think we're gonna go... Oh, shoot. Um, I hope those lower routes aren't important. <laughs> I only focused on the, the flower because I looked like the... Yeah. Hmm... Hmm. <laughs> can I restart that? I probably can't, because I don't think that will be back. Oh, it is. Really? Okay. Let's try the other path, son. <laughs> there may or may not be red coins. You never know. By the way, transformations are a lot faster in the uh, Super NES version of the game for some reason. I don't know why it's slower in this one, though. So, eh. anyway, I'm just going to go around here go this way. You know, I think there would have been enough time for me to take all three routes. I'll just take a hit here, and then go along the upper route, and then when I go over to here, yeah, I would have made it through all three routes anyway, so I guess it is possible speedrun tactics if you want to collect every coin, I, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so now we got one more sort of dealio to do here. Remember, every time you touch the block, uh, touch the arrow lift, it's not a block, it's a circle. <laughs> it will it'll start moving in the direction of that arrow, so timing is key to getting yourself where you need to be. Alright, let's <laughs> move on. And looking good so far in terms of collectibles, so we probably missed tons of stuff. <laughs> I forgot what's over here. I think it's like a little mini... No, it's not a mini boss like I thought. Might be thinking of another later level. What's up? Uh, uh, you got in my way! You got in my way! <laughs> oh, I like these spawn some stars too. That's sad. 
That's sad, but I got 20 stars before the boss, if the, if the, uh, the ring before the boss, you know, the checkpoint ring before the boss. Oh! Oh, oh, I forgot their names. I think it's like Dizzy Daisy or something like that. I, I forgot. <laughs> but yeah, they're, they're fake flowers, basically. Um, for this, you probably want to get them to destroy that for you. Because shooting an egg down there will kind of make it difficult. Because <laughs> it'll just ricochet down and carve a hole out for you. The same with over here to an extent, because you just want to kind of let them make a hole for you and then you go through it. Or, you know, I guess you could bash your head through that as well, but... Yeah, the shy guys, they're... They're just kind of... They're kind of messing with you. <laughs> they are there to try and bomb you. Well, you're trying to do other stuff, basically, but sometimes you can use them to your advantage. And ain't needless to say, these pots, you've always got to knock off of something to get their contents. In this case, it is a key. And I'm just going to run back now. And we are... Oh, no! I got my head stuck. <laughs> I think that was the trap. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Was there any good meat? Okay, I was just... I forgot to check the Shy Guy pipe. Because you know how they, you, they can sometimes let you go inside the Shy Guy pipes and whatnot. Okay, so I think this is just for coins. Yeah, just the one red coin. But it is unnecessary red coin. And then this should lead to a locked door eventually. Um, tutorial on these. When throwing, you may want to stop the aiming cursor of so you can yell, listen greatly, increase your accuracy talking about these question mark well you can't actually see it's there okay there we go yeah it's a question mark and you hit that wheel and then the spiky thing goes up you gotta hit it at least twice though to get it to move up uh far enough you also got to give it some some time to move there we go and then you can move underneath it if you only do it once you're just gonna get spiked by trying to run under it so yeah anyway anyway this is the shot guys are basically if you need to go back to get that key because the key is a necessary thing, if I recall correctly. Uh, yes it is! Yes it is! <laughs> and we're off! Is it blocked? No, it's not blocked. Okay, so we can always go back and get eggs, I suppose. <laughs> um, I think this is... Oh, it's a midpoint ring, so let's not get that just yet. Let's go around and see the other routes. Uh, this one I can go back and forth between, because it's not a... It's not like a pipe or an... Oh, it is a pipe. Uh, okay, oh, we can still go back. That's that's nice. <laughs> okay, but what is where does the door lead to? I, I kind of forgot this particular split path. Uh, like, oh, we got we got the most unsafe word critter in the world, and it's so difficult to pound the ground there when they're doing their bouncy bouncy. So that was just like a, a side area that's not optional if you're going for 100%. Thus, meaning. That that area up ahead is probably the way forward. So I'm gonna hit that because I'm probably not gonna be back to it. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and flop on through here and see how things go. Because I certainly don't wanna hit that midpoint after I may miss a red coin or something like that, as that would be kinda kinda sad. <laughs> uh, I think I only need to hit this once this time because it's. It's kind of hanging low enough this time, there we go. Now this next one, I think, yeah, I gotta get all the way down to the bottom. And it's kind of kind of off screen here, but that is okay, as long as I time myself well. I can do it! Do not touch the thorns, they'll knock you out! You can destroy the thorns by hitting them with eggs. Thank you for that tutorial that I already got, that I already gave the people. I want to see what's up above this. Nothing? Okay. <laughs> I like that squeaking sound uh, that, 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 those, that the things make. There's other things that make that squeaking sound as well as it's kind of used, but yeah. I don't think there's anything hidden in the thorns, uh, but there is in other levels. If, so, whenever you see like a gap where the thorns are, you may or may not want to... Oh wait, this has actually got something hidden in it. Yup! It's got a door! It's got a door! <laughs> I remember that one because it's mandatory, but I mean, the other ones I don't think have any sort of things hidden in them. How am I doing collectible-wise, though? Um, I think there will be four more coins coming up. Yes, this is definitely a place that has four more coins. There's also bandits, so 
be wary of where those bandits are. So what they do is they jump when they hit when they uh, when they go off the edge of things. So you can kind of use that to your advantage by not allowing them to come down until you're ready for them to come down. And see, like that one. Now they're going around the top there because they don't know what to do because they always jump when they go along that edge there. Yeah. <laughs> As I said, use their jumping to your advantage. And you, you should have noticed that from past levels when he moved around to try and get you anyway, so... Um... Uh, yeah, I knew he was gonna go up. Just mandatory for him to go up. Oh, I can't bonk you on the hit over there, really? I guess I'm gonna have to... I just want to get them out of my way mainly more than anything. Uh, oh, he's... He's been... He's between the transition points. Um, come down over... Over... I... He's just not doing what I want him to do now. <laughs> okay, fine. I'll just if you don't if you don't want to play, you have a good day. <laughs> okay, that one's got the key. There's a red coin. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Dang you, bandits! Dang you, bandits! Oh, I just want to pop you now because you you've got one health left. No, oh, no, 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 no! Pop! There we go. <laughs> I was, I was not looking ahead enough. That was my own fault. Luckily, I've still got my 20 stars. <laughs> There's my last red coin. Uh, I just want to see what's in the other pots, just for kicks, though. Because uh, I'm, I'm going to probably have to use my uh, 20 star thing anyway. So I'm just going to take a peek see around and see if... Uh... <laughs> sneaky, sneaky bandits. Uh, okay, so there's that key for that giblet there. Ah! <laughs> as long as I get it recovered to 10 before I use the uh, 20 um, star thing, we will be golden. Okay, I got another one popped there. Now I can go and take care of that. Nothing in there! <laughs> all, all this work that I'm doing for nothing. For nothing! <laughs> um, I think, actually, there's something up above that midpoint ring, but I just want to kind of make sure that I get everything set up here before I do that. Like, just to make sure I'm 100% cleared out. Um... Um, now, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm, what I'm just gonna do here, I'm gonna do the, oops, I'm gonna do this, and then I'll save my starages as well as my keyages. <laughs> Let's see what's up here. Um, what is up there? Nothing. <laughs> okay, there. I mean, it's it's a hidden doorway. I mean, it's a hidden area of sorts, but it's not really important or anything. So, okay, I got this all cleared out, and we're off. Everything. Another midpoint. I didn't have to use my Tony Star thing. What a waste. What a waste. Um, but some of these pots, they do come after you. If I were, oh no, they don't really. I thought some of these pots come after you. Maybe I'm thinking of a later level. Maybe, 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 perhaps. I didn't remember there being two midpoints. I guess that midpoint in the other room was for just that room, and I got ahead of myself. Because, yeah, maybe they were expecting you to lose a bunch of stars like I did, and then just come through here, and then get your stars refilled again, maybe. Might be, could be. Anyway, boss time! The potted ghost! It's a pot, and there's a ghost. Hey, Kamek. Yoshi, dear, that baby's going to mean disaster for the Koopas. <laughs> well, I gotta give give him that. <laughs> that baby has destroyed the Koopas so many times over. <laughs> so get him here while you get before you get hurt by accident. But I, but I think that many of the peeps in the Mario Kingdom are pretty capable of taking on the Koopas, including Peach herself, even though she gets kidnapped a lot, probably on purpose. So we, all, we, all we gotta do here is just push them off the edge. And those shy guys will try and help them back on the field, but, <laughs> but the objective is just to keep pushing them off the edge and avoid the fire. He doesn't shoot fire all that often, so you can just keep pushing and pushing and pushing. Once the shy guys are uh, pushed off themselves, won't be able to recover himself. And yeah, you just keep pushing and oh, and he, uh oh, I win! I win! Woo! <laughs> 
And the next world is open up. Now since I got a perfect score of 800 for the world, you know we aren't going over to the next world just yet. Oh, no, 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 no. We've got other stuff to do. Namely, another extra level that's going to unlock, as you would expect. <laughs> Perfection! Extra two open! And now... And now we also get a cutscene! Wait for it! Wait for it, because I didn't forget it this time! <laughs> go, little Yoshi, go! <laughs> well, it's normal-sized Yoshi, with a really zoomed-out camera. Explode that tower viciously, and erect your flag as the new owner of this land. <laughs> Alright, back over to World 2. I think what I'm going to do here, just for the sake of saving time in the future, is go over to the bonus. Because we didn't get a, the chance to have any sort of bonus level here. So scratch and match again. This is the point that I said that I was going to read it. If I didn't read it up to this point, uh, basically, only I didn't really say it was up to this point. I just kind of hinted that I was I was gonna unlock this as a bonus challenge soon. But yeah, it's just here's their scratch and match. If you want to try getting three one ups, go for it. <laughs> I mean, excuse me, try getting three baby Mario heads, go for it. Probably be pretty dang easy with save states on an emulator though. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's easier with save states, though. And with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when we start World 3. But wait, no. No, wait, wait, no, I forgot. Wait, I forgot. Extra 2. <laughs> I'm just so used to saying the next world after I finish, I mean, I should say after I see a world open up that I just got excited and went over to the number 3 tab. No, 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 no. Extra 2, definitely. Definitely. <laughs>